The first Royal Bull's Head Inn was built in 1847 by a convict named William Horton who had done uh, some work in hotels in Ipswich. It became a community hub, great for drinking, meetings and so forth. Some major renovations were done in 1975 to restore it to what we hopefully we think it looks like, the inn of Horton's day. I think it has a huge role in heritage tourism and er education. We have uh, open days um, for visitors of all ages and we have different focus each open day. We've been talking for a while at trying to introduce technology in an inobtrusive way because we don't want to spoil the heritage feel of the inn. We have, uh, we have no funding uh, whatsoever. We also look for grants and that's where um, we were lucky enough to be able to apply for one of the Toowoomba Regional Council grants in that we wanted to be able to add to the experience of young people um, so that it improved their time while they were here. The money from the grant allowed us to buy the iPads and then we needed to work on the project full stop. So that when the visitor arrives um, they can uh, book uh, one of the iPads and they can wander around and have a self-guided tour themselves anyway. They can use the videos to enhance what they see in each room and we believe um, it really interests obviously younger people but we're also finding that the younger people like to show it to grandma and grandpa and they're loving it too so it's um, working and it wasn't a huge task I mean all grants you've got paperwork to fill in but it wasn't impossible you know it, w it didn't take that long really I mean, that was our first application for those and, and we got it. If you meet the criteria and you write to the criteria, then I'm sure you'll be successful as well. <laughs>